Oh, yes, yes. They have the audacity to go after anything. The Seven. Dragons. Gods. No ancient artifact that relates can escape their greedy ambitions. Still, this time is different. Who do they think they are going after the Abyss Order's treasures? Oh, Traveler, it's you. Huh? Ganyu, what are you doing here with Lan? Do you have a commission you need to post? Hello. We were just discussing the treasure hoarders. Yes. We were just saying how even the audacious treasure hoarders should know better than to mess with the Abyss. It's just too evil. But we recently received intel from the Ministry of Civil Affairs that two big-time treasure hoarders in Liyue and Mondstadt are planning some big joint operation. Two big-time treasure hoarders? Yes. They're known as Big Sis of the South and Raptor of the North. Oh, Raptor! Paimon remembers he tried to run away from Amber and Mondstadt. But who is Big Sis of the South? You are correct. She's the head of the treasure hoarders in Liyue. As I understand it, the treasure hoarders all call her boss. Some say that the god of thieves even bestowed a gift upon her for her exploits, making her big sis of the gods. But that's probably just a wild rumor. Anyway, the treasure hoarders discovered some previously unexplored ruins that the Abyss Order has been secretly guarding in the shadows. Despite how dangerous that makes it, all the treasure hoarders can think about is what kinds of treasure could be inside. They have already devised a plan. They will send out a decoy to divert the Abyss Order's forces away from the ruins, then send an expert thief inside to steal the treasure. To this end, Big Sis and Raptor have reportedly recruited a certain Grand Thief from Fontaine. Grand Thief? That's quite an impressive sounding title. Oh, indeed. He is an extraordinary individual. The Grand Thief is highly respected in the Treasure Hoarders, in the same way that we adventurers look up to great adventurers. Ah, so you're familiar with the author of the Tavat Travel Guide, then. Correct. The Grand Thief is someone as renowned as her. So, despite being relative big-timers in Liyue and Mondstadt, Big Sis and Raptor had to put in a lot of work to convince a thief of his status to come and personally oversee this operation. With the major changes in Liyue recently, the Ministry of Civil Affairs and the Millilith already have their hands full. They don't have any time to investigate rumors about treasure hoarder activity. But anything related to the Abyss makes me feel like there is some unknown danger lurking beneath the surface. So I decided to come to the Adventurer's Guild to post a commission. Leave this commission to us! Oh, thank you so much. Good to see this in the hands of a reliable guild member. Well then, good luck. The guild will take care of the details of this commission. Should I save this money? of treasure order activity here. They must have come to these ruins. Let's go deeper inside. Paimon sure hopes Ganyu's information is reliable. There aren't many guards here. Looks like their plan to draw away the Abyss Order's forces really worked.
More signs that a treasure hoarder was here. This should be the right direction. But... Why does it feel stranger and stranger as we make it deeper into these ruins? <laughs> um... Be careful now! Paimon's right behind you! Is he praying to something? <gasps> That's... Why is the Statue of the Seven hanging upside down? And the statue's hands... Paimon remembers they're normally holding an orb, right? But... This statue is holding... What is that? Uh... Paimon has a really bad feeling about this. And... The Grand Thief hasn't moved an inch. Do... Do you think he's... Um... Hello? Are you okay, Miss? He... He's dead! Paimon doesn't feel so good! Uh, let's get out of here, and fast! We should report back to Ganyu and Lon! Ah! Now what?! We can't stay here! Quick, run! Rise. Life goes on. on the secrets of the Abyss. You have come here. You have seen our secrets. For this, you must pay the price. As a herald, I will mete out your punishment. An Abyss herald? Dane. Dainsleith. Oh, I thought you were just a couple of pests that stumbled in here by mistake. So, you are with Dainsleif, that constant annoyance in our affairs. Did he send you here to die? His resistance against the Abyss has gone nowhere for a long time. There is nothing you can do to change the tide. The Abyss 
is unstoppable. What is this power? Pirates never seen it before. Careful, please don't get cocky. <sighs> So, we meet again. A little sooner than I had expected. Hey, it's Dane! Judging by your expression, it seems you just experienced something quite strange. Could it be that you encountered an Abyss Herald in those ruins? Huh? How did you know that? I've been on the Abyss Herald's trail. I didn't expect to find you here as well. An inverted statue of the Seven, holding abyssal power in its hands. No, I have never seen such a thing during my time fighting the Abyss. Though I have had my suspicions. Tell me the rest of what happened in there. So you escaped the ruined depths filled with abyssal power, and then? And then, as we got close to the exit, an Abyss Herald suddenly appeared and blocked our way! We fought a big battle with that thing. Maybe it hasn't gotten too far yet. Yes, this is a rare opportunity indeed. Come, let's catch up to it. Let's go! A rare opportunity? With Dane helping out, maybe we'll be able to solve more mysteries about the Abyss! <laughs> hmm. 